how can we know the current status, trends and likely futures of our coral reefs with certainty? Prized in 1998, the global average hard coral cover on the world's coral reefs was high and stable. But a single mass coral bleaching event killed 8% of the world's coral. Coral cover recovered during the next decade until a succession of large-scale bleaching events killed 14% of the world's coral. Coral reefs simply hadn't the time between bleaching events to recover. As a consequence, the global average cover of algae on the world's coral reefs has increased by 20%. Algal dominance reduces the ability of corals and the marine life they support to re-establish themselves. It's time to step up our efforts to protect and restore our coral reefs. To help communities, businesses and governments conserve and manage our vital coral reefs, the Global Coral Reef Monitoring Network has released a new report examining the status and trends of the world's coral reefs. Several hundred scientists and organisations contributed to this report which is based on a global data set of almost 2 million observations from over 12,000 sites in 73 countries. Now, in the first global report since 2008, you can discover the status, trends and likely futures of your coral reefs to help you make a positive difference. To learn more and read the report, visit www.gcrmn.net.